Hi everybody, it's Miranda here at Doing Life and today in my life, I have my Norley box. Do you wanna know what's in it? Then stick around. There must be another way, there must be conscience. about the Norley box. I did go ahead and kind of take all of the uh, paper and the uh, bubble wrap out of it and it is packaged really nicely. The Norley box is $69.95 a month so it is a little bit more pricey than your normal subscription box if you're used to getting you know like the makeup ones or anything like that but I do feel like you get some quality items in here. Uh, you do pay a $7 shipping fee to the US, but it's coming all the way from Scandinavia. I have been getting this box for a couple months now. It is bi-monthly, and the one that I have in my hand here is the August box. Uh, this one, I'll start off by saying as well that I did receive this particular one for review, but my honest opinion will be um, what I portray in this video, of course, like any other box. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to tell you my exact thoughts on how I feel about it. So I do want to though thank uh, the Norley team for sending it to me and uh, I'm really excited to open and see what's in here. They are usually a themed box. I've gotten a breakfast themed box and a Huga themed box. And this one for the month of August is the Nordic Tapas box. It says, summers are made for great food. For August box, I have carefully picked out beautiful items to set the style of a Nordic tapas table. Although tapas is Spanish snacking, small portions of a variety of dishes is widespread throughout the world. A Nordic tapas is cozy assemblage of great Nordic food and equally important, a relaxed atmosphere. I see a warm summer evening on the terrace, good friends gathered around the tapas and cold rosé wine in the glasses. Yes, please. So can I come to Scandinavia and sit on your terrace because I would love to have some wine. Uh, I'm just being a little honest. It's been a little crazy around here lately. And as of the filming of this video, I have two weeks before my move and I get to live with my husband again and I can't wait. I really love home decor and decorating and so this box is right up my alley. You get two to five items and the box is uh, worth about $90 or more of course and so it's if you're looking for to spend you know seventy dollars and get three hundred dollars worth of items you're probably not going to um get that but you are getting quality items that you will not find in the u.s you cannot just go out to the local target and buy these items which i think is great because who doesn't want some decor items in their house that nobody else has the first item that I'm pulling out are these really cute utensils. There's a spoon and two forks in here. Let's read about them. Let's see. It says gift. It says small spoon and forks and bamboo from House Doctor. The spoon can be used as a salt spoon. I have this little thing that I keep my salt in from, I think it's by, um, mud pie and it's so cute it says salt on it and i don't have a spoon in there i usually just throw my hand in there and sprinkle it in my food or you know like when i'm cooking that's what i use that one for so let's open these up and take a look at these little cuties so here is the spoon that would be great in there and then two little forks i really like these 
smell like bamboo. All right, there's those. The next item in here, it looks like some napkins. They are in a gray and white striped. I don't know how many's in here. Golly, it looks like a lot. Maybe like 20-ish maybe? Let's see. It says paper napkins from Brost Copenhagen in a big striped pattern, simplicity and classy. Brost Copenhagen has a natural flair for design that elevates everyday items. I find these beautiful paper napkins irresistible and they're perfect for a Nordic tapas. The napkins are biodegradable, water-based color, and bleached without chlorine, and I believe they're $3. Let's just kind of open it a little bit. I don't want to take any out because I want to be able to keep them in here, but they are really nice quality feeling. One of the favorite things that I have gotten out of this box is... Uh, some bowls and I believe they were the Brost Copenhagen as well and they're awesome. I love them. I want to order more. The next thing is in some bubble wrap. Whatever it is, it's heavy. Throw that down there. It says Norman Copenhagen Craft Cellar. Right, so this is what we have here. That is nice and heavy. What is this thing? Oh, it's a marble salt jar. Also from Norman Copenhagen is the salt jar. Marble has a fine hard surface with a beautiful natural pattern. Each piece of stone is unique in color and composition. The salt jar is a born classic with exclusive material selection and distinctive rounded design. <coughs> Excuse me. The marble's natural heaviness provides a kitchen, kitchen accessory that exudes quality. Place the jar on the dining room table or by the, and by the stovetop for everyday cooking. This thing's worth $51. Now, if you have items that are marble, they are pricey. So that will be really cute when I move. Put it down here, maybe you can see it better against the black, my black shirt, but that's really cute and it will uh, be a classy little addition to my table or wherever I decide to put it. I have other items that are marble. I have a rolling pin that's marble that I love and salt shakers pepper or whatever so this will look really cute in my kitchen so let's stick that right there and then i have one more item also by norman copenhagen i have that stuff all over me from the packaging our packing material and it is something it's a part cutting board it says Part is a collection of cutting board that unifies decoration and function. The simple details that decorate each part cutting board all have a functional purpose while still giving the design an aesthetic value. The part snacking board is ideal for small cutting task and serving. Okay. It is beautiful, you guys. That is really cute. If you don't know, I collect uh, cutting boards and wooden items in my kitchen. I have my grandmother's biscuit board. I have a cutting board that Mike made me. I have all kinds of wooden items and I love all of them. This one happens to be oak and it is Natural hardwood oak, treated with food approved oil, wash it by hand and treat it with cooking oil once in a while and you have a kitchen companion forever. The board is aesthetically decorative and I recommend to use it directly on the dining table and store it on the kitchen counter while not in use. And it's worth $68. Now, if you go to any uh, high-end 
store, you know that cutting boards, good ones, heavy ones are pricey. So I'm glad I got this. And it would look really cute with some little cheeses or meats and cheeses. Yeah, little snack tray will be really cute on that. A uh, little recap here. I'll just put everything kind of together for you. So this is what I have. I have the napkins, I have the little utensils, which I think are super cute, the marble salt jar, and then the uh, cutting board. I thought I had my phone near me, I do. And I'll just tell you exactly really quick how much this August box was worth. Pull up, my phone's gonna go dead. I haven't charged it all day, so. Let's see, 68 plus 51 plus three equals $122. So I paid uh, about 77-ish, well, I would have paid 77-ish dollars and I got over a $100 value right here. So I think this is pretty good. Uh, I love it. <laughs> I hope everybody else enjoyed this video. Thank you, Norley, for sending it to me for review. I, this one knocked it out of the park, in my opinion. I hope everybody has a lovely day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.